Hey YouTubers, welcome back. Um, this is me old um, Bell Bullet helmet and what we're looking at doing today is adding some graphics to it. So I've got two of them. I'll see where I want to do with it. Uh, what I've done is got myself a little razor blade because I think I may need to sort of place it somewhere and then cut it out nice and neat. Uh, I'll clean it so I've got some cleaner so I'll just clean it down. Um, screwdriver offers reasons just to remove off in there. For those who don't know, uh, Bill actually designed it so you can use that a coin. Well, if you're out on the road, you can just use a coin to remove that. So um, we'll take that off, wipe it down. I don't know if you really want to see a video of that because it's pretty obvious on how to do it. But realistically, I'm looking to have that sit somewhere there. And then on the other side, maybe a bit more of a full, full effect. Um, but let's see, mate. Right? Don't forget to um, subscribe again, guys. So welcome back for the other one. Um, if you're new here and you're here because of the helmet or just maybe some of the stuff that I'm doing, thanks for joining. So um, yeah, let's go, eh? All right. So what I'm looking at doing um, is peeling this. This is double double side. So yeah, you know, you take one layer off and then you're left with the original part and then the little bits will stay behind uh, and then peel that off again and what I think is going to happen is I'll try and get as much as, of a, as I can here but I'll end up cutting a little bit with the blade just to peel that off and then on the other side when I turn it around I'm probably going to have to sacrifice a bit more of that because I think it will look good sort of sitting here but the problem is where I really want it there, the skull, when I'm getting cut and I don't want to cut that. This is the Punisher symbol, so yeah, so um, maybe do exactly the same and start it a bit more in the middle here and go backwards. Maybe that'll work. And it'll leave me a bit of space if I ever wanted to do something else or across the front. We'll see what happens. Um, I did do a review of this helmet as well. And I'll leave you the link at the end of the video, at the end of this video. Um, it's actually quite noisy. Um, it whistles. There's an actual whistle. So I did it by having a microphone on the inside while I was riding. And you can hear the difference with the visor up and down. And you get this whistling sound. Fantastic helmet. Very lightweight. Um, great vision. You know, as good as an open face helmet when it comes to vision. So, yeah, a couple of times when I was riding with this, my mates told me that it... Uh, Reminds them of a uh, you know an astronaut's helmet, and uh, maybe that's why I'm going to do some changes to it. So let's have a look at this and see how it plays out. All right, so I've just sprayed the helmet a little bit just to get that wetness down because I've seen some professionals do that. No big deal. I'll wipe it clean, and I just peel one layer off. And I think when I go to stick it now, as much as I want it to be, and sacrifice just a tad, I can kind of go down there. Oh, the curve in this is going to make it a bit tricky. Yeah, definitely. The curvature of the helmet is going to make this real tricky. Not like what I expected. And to be quite honest with you, I don't know if it's actually going to work. It's kind of fighting against itself as I push the water out. Yeah, it's kind of funny fighting on itself where it wants to lift. Alright, let me keep going with this because you probably don't want to watch me trying to struggle with this for 10 minutes. Uh, let me keep going and I'll bring you back. Okay, so 10 minutes later actually more like nearly 20 minutes later 
what happened. Um, pretty good. I managed to managed to peel off that um, that skin. Uh, some of the things I did differently was, as an example, and I've left it out to show you, is this little bit here I cut out, and I'll make that fit in there where it needs to be to com complete that circle, um, because that's where the paper was starting to fold over. Um, yeah, it ended up being pretty good. Um, I went a little bit beyond um, just here, because see how it folded over? That actually should be a star point. It went over the top of it, and all I did was cut that off, so it looks a bit kind of where it's supposed to be. Otherwise, everything else was down good. Everything else was pretty smooth. Um, still looks like it looks like it's supposed to be part of the helmet. Um, yeah, so I'll add that little bit on there now, and then I'll do the other side. Yeah. So even if you look here, I've left this, and what I'll do is I'll run my blade, and I'll cut it off nice and tight. And once I cut that nice and tight, it'll stick the rest of it down and. Uh, when I'm using a visor, the visor will cover that anyway. Otherwise, um, yeah, guys, don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to keep working, and I'll show you the finished product. Alrighty, so here you go. Here's the end product. I'll zoom in on that. I'll show you some of the little links that I've done, which is mainly that part there. Right? That's that side of the helmet. Turn she around, and that's the other side. Yeah, not too bad. So two stickers off eBay. Uh, and a little bit of effort. Looks pretty good. I think it breaks it up a bit. Um, I've got room for more, so I'll see if I want to put something up there. I'm thinking about making some teeth along here, although that's generally where I'm intending on putting my next GoPro. But uh, yeah, maybe make a mouth out of that. So anyway guys, hopefully um, you've liked that idea. Uh, if you did, please again hit that subscribe. I really want those uh, thousand subs. Um, I think it's the way I can get a bit more um, views. So I hope you like it. Anyway, Punisher sticker on a bell bullet helmet. Um, pretty tidy. The black and white theme looks pretty good. And again, all I can say is thank you very much guys for sticking around and for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments, eh? See you on the next one.